I'm a little bit like an onion. There's many layers and you've got to peel back the layers to be able to get to know me. So I placed the first runner up twice before I won my Miss Australia title. Yeah. So you've got all the different aspects. You've got swimwear, evening wear, fun fashion, interview, photogenic, and then top five do on stage questions. Do you know the questions? No. You, really, that must no. be hectic. And I don't really watch the news, I don't. But when I'm leading up to a pageant, yeah. I watch the news just so I know what's going oh, on. Wow. Yeah, it's just that's how my really brain good. works and how everything sort of all matches yeah. in together. <laughs> <laughs> I feel that we're really connected. Conversation flows and we're having a really good chat. What's your plan when you get out of here? Travel. <laughs> okay, so pretty well you live for adventure. Love adventure. <laughs> I've base jumped all around the world. Have you done the paragliding where you like run and jump off the cliff? With the parasol. Yeah. yeah, yeah, I've done that. I imagine that's a similar feeling to space jumping though, like to like, well, like jump. base jumping, you're just falling. Like with paragliding, you feel where you get picked up straight away, where base jumping you run and you jump and you're falling. So. Yeah, I think space jumping would be yeah, pretty dangerous. Yeah. <laughs> It is space jumping, isn't it? You're looking at me like it's not called space jumping. It's it's base jumping. Base, is it? Yeah. I thought it was called space jumping. Base jumping. <laughs> <laughs> um. Thanks for playing hard, yeah, being my queen. It's been so much fun. Give us a hug. Aww. I had a really nice conversation with Lockie, but I didn't get a rose. And that certainly makes me a little worried. 